Okay, thus, Jadavadashi, and I just logged on to Steam today and found a nice little present waiting for me. And that is Napoleon Total War The Peninsular Campaign. And I've been quite excited about this little add-on for Napoleon Total War for a while now, and uh, I know that I've got maybe a lot going, uh, a lot on my plate right now between uh, all the different Let's Plays I'm doing. But uh, I'll, I'll be fine. I should be. Uh, I should find a way to uh, to pull through everything. And honestly, I'm going to start up a, a peninsular campaign here because I know a lot of people, like I said, are, are interested in it. A lot of people are curious in it. And um, hopefully, uh, if I if I get it out today, I may be able to beat any competition that might be out there. So I haven't even clicked on this tab yet. But uh, as soon as I loaded up the game, you can notice that sort of the hue has changed from that sort of blue hue to this weird uh, orangish brownish kind of uh, backdrop. Personally, I thought the blue looked a little bit cooler than this, but, uh, you know, taker's choice, I suppose. But I haven't clicked on this tab yet, so let's see what happens. And, um, you can see that this campaign map is just Spain, and I've got a choice uh, of playing between uh, Great Britain, Spain, and France. And it uh, looks like Great Britain just starts with Gibraltar, and that's it. Um, Spain starts with a couple territories uh, in the south and one in the east. And France has everything. <laughs> um, so, when, when looking at uh, which one I'm going to choose to play as, uh, I think I'm going to choose to play as Spain, personally. I think it's going to be the, the most interesting... Uh, I've already played as Great Britain in my last Napoleon Total War campaign, and I personally think playing as France would be really boring, considering you already own everything. So I think it would be kind of lame. But um, Spain, to me, looks the coolest. Also, I'm really interested in the Spanish guerrillas and everything. So I'm just going to kick the uh, difficulty up too hard. And... Um, just look at the victory condition here. Ensure that France owns no more than five regions, while holding the regions shown. And I uh, gotta complete this by the end of December uh, 1850. Or sorry, 1815. So, uh, I guess let's kick this thing off. The edges of their peninsula by France and the traitors who helped them, Spain is not yet out of the fight. The Supreme Central Junta and its successor, the Supreme Regency, authorized the forming of local bands to fight guerrilla, the little war, against the invaders. Guerrilla bands should be used to frustrate the plans and harass the peripheries of the French armies, as both separate actions and in coordination with British forces currently based in Portugal. This cooperation with heretical Great Britain is an uneasy one, as your two countries have long been enemies with opposing doctrines and are now united only in the desire to rid Europe of Napoleon's imperialism. There is, of course, another war to be won also. A war of words, hearts, and minds in the villages and towns surrounding the capital, Madrid. Bonapartists provocateurs are speaking out against Spanish sovereignty and the resistance to their rule, and the priesthood must be used to change the people's minds and remind them what it is to be a proud and patriotic people once more. Militarily, Madrid is the center of French power in Spain, so its liberation is an absolute priority. In the north of the country, the British will be taking advantage of the coasts to land fresh troops from England and fresh supplies from its colonies. So a concentration of effort should also be made to keep the French presence in those regions as insignificant as possible. Alright, so here you go. There's your intro. Ground for recruit unit, merchantman, trade ship, um, blah blah blah. So... As you can see, we've got quite a daunting task ahead of us. And, um, just zooming back over here. Uh, while it's on my mind, I may as well, uh, recruit that trade ship. Wanna 
does the Spanish Navy consist of? Not a whole hell of a lot. Apparently those islands are, are non... Um, th th there's no city on those islands. Not anymore, apparently. Anyway, so just looking at our status in the world, we've got a couple territories down here. We've got a, a, a priest. So, I mean, off the bat, I'm going to send this priest over here. And there's a new symbol right there. I don't know what that symbol means, and I can't really tell what it is. It kind of looks like there's a book on fire. Do I have one over here? Yeah, I do. Let's see if, uh... Oh, it tells me how much uh, anti-French sediment there is there. Um, and I guess you change that by uh, sending, like, uh, priests or whatever. Um, let's also see... Uh, build up things a little bit. Let's see what uh, kind of troops we have. Same kind of things. Uh, we've got, you know, Hussars. Lanceros, Guerrilla Lanceros, Guerrilla Hussars, uh, Nine Pounder Artillery, Guerrillas, more Guerrillas, and, uh, you know, Line Infantry, Fusiliers, and Provincial Militia. So. Let's go another guy over here. What's the cemetery do? Spreads anti-French sediment. Spawn some dudes. Put a lumber mill up. Take this Spanish army and attack right over here off the bat. And uh, also I saw at the intro, apparently we've got some troops in the north. We've got some guerrillas. I don't know if there, any of them are really enough to... take over any of the French regions, so I'm just going to have them, uh, burn what they can, and then hide out back in the woods. And I guess I also have him move over here. What's a Guerrero do? Let's see, does it tell me? I don't know, but he looks very sad in the portrait. Sabotage, harass army, and assassinate. So I guess they're like spies. Let's, uh, I don't know. Sabotage that. Or can I assassinate this guy? Nope, apparently he got executed instead. Oh, we've also got, um... New technologies. Not very many technologies. Um, colonial funding. Which does what? Plus 10 military supplies. And, uh, okay, sure, why not. Let's look to see if I've got any, uh... Spend the last uh, bit of my resources and then see if I can end the turn. <laughs> Apparently, Portugal's also in the game, but you can't play as them, oddly enough. Alright, let's uh, first off go and take this. Okay. Mi 